you are joining on. Hey guys. We were just talking about getting comfortable being warm. Um, I was saying when we relax deeply like this, body temperature drops about four degrees. So it's good to have socks, a blanket, something to be prepared for to be a little cooler than you are right now. Okay. Hey Suzanne. We're gonna get started with uh, a little seated practice. We'll start there and then we'll recline however we wanna be. I like to take that ramp pose, so where you take one of the, like a bolster or a cushion or something, and you prop it up on a block and you lay back on that. But of course you can rest however you want. So if you did fall asleep, wake you back up, okay? Ideally, you want to practice in a dark, quiet space. And I would like sharp drawings, sounds, you know, um, anywhere you want to rest is cool, but it's going to take the time, gather your props, get what you need to be comfy, and then we're going to start in seated here. Nice, comfortable seat, any way you want to be, cross-legged, legs out, it's all good. Wiggle into your sits bones. Start with some simple neck rolls, shoulder rolls, roll them up, back and down, real mindful rolls. Inhale, shrug them up. Exhale, roll them back and down. A few more times. Couple more big shoulder rolls. Relax the shoulders. Do some neck rolls now. Drop the chin down into the chest. Start slowly, gradually. Go a little side to side. Trace the collarbones. If your neck feels ready for some full rolls, go for it. Reverse if you need to. To neutral. A little twist to the right, bring out the midsection. If you just ate something, be gentle with yourself. A few deep breaths here, mindfully in and mindfully out. And slow unwind and go the other way right out slow back to center stretch the legs out long in front of you Give them a shake out. Take your arms out in front of you, say stop, and circle out your wrists and your ankles at the same time. Reverse the direction. And 
And as you're sitting here, stop your circles. Interlace your fingers, push your palms forward. Push the palms forward really strongly as you round back. Scoop the tailbone, lean back, take a big deep breath. And then push through the palms, sit up tall, take the arms back, gently arch back. And release the arms down. Shake the legs out. Little fold over the legs, bend the knees, take a little hinge forward, make it feel good. Swing it around to a quick tabletop, all fours. And roll through some cat cows. So gently arch the spine, look up. Exhale, round the back. Tuck the chin, sweep the tail. Some gentle cat cows here, loosen up the spine, making it a little bit easier to rest comfortably still in a moment. Tabletop, pick up the feet, circle out at the ankles. And then cross at the ankles, roll it back. Come to seated. And then setting up to rest. So coming into a comfortable position, however you want to be. I like resting back on a bolster, propped up onto a block there, making a little ramp. You could lay any way you want, however you're going to be comfortable and still. So take a little extra time. Socks are a good idea. Blankets a good idea. about what yoga nidra is a little bit. It translates to mean sleep yoga. And what happens is it's a guided relaxation, very similar to a traditional meditation. And the idea is you come to a relaxed position, you listen to a guided meditation, so you're not in your busy mind thinking, you've got something to concentrate on the guide's voice. You're totally relaxed without going into REM sleep or deep dream sleep where our body heals and actually is active. And what we've found that Yoga Nidra does, this type of guided meditation, is it kind of calms the wavelengths of the brain, slows things down, helps with stress, helps us to sleep better, adapting this as a practice, doing this regularly, kind of trains us to go into this place of deep rest. So we want to mimic that time right before we fall asleep in bed. So set yourself up, finish doing what you need to do to get comfortable, to find a seat, excuse me, a comfortable resting position. Kind of tuck the shoulders underneath you, wiggle the hips out, scratch the itch, adjust your shirt, do what you need to do. And once you've found your comfortable resting spot, if you can, close down the eyes. Or soften the gaze.
Letting the eyes be soft in their sockets. Say to yourself right now, I am practicing yoga nidra. I am awake. I am present. I am listening. Ideally, we'll stay awake through the whole time. I'll be honest with you, rarely do I stay awake through an entire yoga nidra, and that's okay. Like I said, I'll wake you up with the same goal at the end. Know that even if you do fall asleep, it's still working. In this comfortable, still position, set the intention to relax. Welcome yourself onto the mat, into your body. Bring your awareness into the room. Hear all the sounds around you without labeling them. Simply listen. Now feel. Feel the air on your exposed parts of skin. Feel the coolness of the air. Maybe you can just smell in the room. Feel the cool air passing through your nostrils, inflating your lungs. Feel the warm exhale air passing over your top lip. Set your intention to relax. Take a moment and witness your thoughts. Welcome the thoughts and let them go. Observe the thoughts without judging them or trying to change them. moment and welcome sensations of joy, of well-being, of bliss. Connect with anything that's bringing you joy. In Yoga Nidra, we said a sankalpa. What is a sankalpa? It is an intention. It is a positive I am statement. My sankalpa is I am happy, I am healthy, I am whole. An attainable goal, something that is positive, something that you want to attract to yourself, setting that like a seed in our subconscious. So take a moment to set a sankalpa. Repeat that sankalpa as an I am statement as it has already happened to you. And gently repeat it three times. Now release your sankalpa, give it up to something bigger. And let's move on. Now, listening to the sound of my voice, simply follow along. Don't concentrate too hard and don't worry if you miss an instruction. <coughs> Excuse me. Try to relax and follow along. If you drift off, no big deal. Gently drift back and follow along to the sound of my voice.
moving into a body scan. Simply bring your awareness to the body parts that call out. Maybe repeat what I say in your mind and move on. You don't need to do anything, just simply follow along. If you get lost, that's okay. Come back to the sound of my voice. Starting at the crown of the head, the very, very top, where the hair meets the scalp. Moving into the right side, the right hand thumb. The right hand thumb, pointer, middle, index, and right finger. Right wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm shoulder, collarbone, right armpit, side body, hip, thigh, knee, shin, ankle, <coughs> right big toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Back of the right hand, palm, top of the right foot, sole, crown of the head, very, very top. Left side, left hand, thumb, index, middle, Brain, pinky. Left wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, collarbone. Left armpit, side body, hip, thigh, knee. Shin, ankle, left big toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Back of the left hand, palm, top of the left foot, sole, crown of the head, very top. Right side of the face, right eye, cheekbone, jaw, right side of the neck, top of the head, left side, left eye, cheekbone, jaw, left side of the neck, the throat center, the heart center, center of the chest, the navel, the pelvis, the groin. The entire right leg, the entire right arm, top of the head, throat center, center of the chest, navel, pelvis, groin. The entire left leg. The crown of the head, the very top. 
back of the head, back of the neck, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade. The space between the shoulder blades, mid back, small of the back, low back, right glute, left glute. The back of the right thigh, right knee, right calf, right ankle. Left glute, back of the left thigh, left knee, calf, ankle. The entire back side of the body. The whole entire back side of the body. Crown of the head, very top. The entire front side of the body. The entire front side of the body. Crown of the head, very top. Right side of the body. The entire right side of the body. Crown of the head, very top. Left side of the body. The entire left side of the body. The whole body all together. The whole entire body all together. Crown of the head, very top. Your third eye, your wisdom center at your brow. Your throat center, communication. The heart center in the middle of the chest, our loving compassion. Our solar plexus chakra at the base of the ribs, our fiery vitality. The stomach. Our emotional body. And the root, the base of the spine, our primal connection. Back to the crown, very top. The whole body together. The whole entire body, all together. Feel all the parts of you that are touching the earth, your points of connection, And now all the spaces between your body and the earth. Feel yourself relax. Awake and aware, but relaxed. Close your eyes and imagine that you're standing at the edge of a field. You see a tree line where a forest begins, only a few yards away. Just on the other side of the tree line, you can see a trail. It looks easy enough to get to the path, so you walk out of the field and into the woods. The 
light in the forest cascades down through the leaves in a soft spray of light. The layers of forest have various textures. The lower undergrowth is a soft green. There are ferns, moss, small saplings struggling for light. The upper canopy of trees covers over you like a huge umbrella. It's like having a stained glass roof. The light green leaves with the light blue and white background create a soft, glowing, ambient light. It's bright, but not so bright you need sunglasses. The path you are on goes down a slight hill and curves, so you decide to explore and walk down the path. It's a beaten path, but it doesn't look too worn. It's a mix of dirt, roots, and small plants but it's much easier to walk in the vegetation-dense area outside the path. Once you round the corner a bit, you can see a stream up ahead. You continue toward it, admiring the large trees and the different kind of bark on each. Some trees have rough bark, some have smooth bark, some have light-colored bark, and others dark, near the stream, you hear the rippling water sounds getting louder. That's a relaxing, constant sound. You can see the rocks just underneath the surface of the water. The water swirls around the rocks and pours over others. Your feet are warm and sore. You decide to take your shoes off and dip your feet into the stream. There's a large tree that has fallen over where you can sit and slip your shoes off. So you do. <clears throat> you place your shoes and socks on the log next to you and dip your bare feet in the stream. The first sensation you notice is cold. The water is very cold and it instantly soothes your feet. As you adjust to the cold, you start to notice that the water is swirling around and over your feet just like the rocks you noticed earlier. As the moving water massages your feet, you notice birds chirping. You hadn't noticed earlier, but there are several different bird sounds. If you really listen, you can also hear the breeze from fluttering the leaves on the trees. Other than that, this is a quiet place. You decide that you'll close your eyes and enjoy the sounds a bit longer. After you have sat on the log long enough, Decide it's time to leave this relaxing place. You grab your shoes and put each on and step to the dry bank of the stream. You see the path that brought you here and head back up the hill and around the corner. As you walk back, many of the trees seem familiar. Now you're getting a different perspective. You can see the bright entrance to your path up ahead. Since there are no trees, it is bright. As you approach the entrance to the path, you decide to stop and linger. You turn around and look down the path, taking note of what you are seeing and hearing. mental picture of how everything looks. This way you can visit this special place anytime you'd like in your head. Finally, you walk out of the forest and find yourself back in a field where it's much brighter.
you pause for a moment, closing the eyes to adjust. As you see the sunlight filtering through your eyelids like a kaleidoscope, feel the warmth of the sun shining on your face. Feel the open air all around you. Now, if you're comfortable, take your right hand to your stomach and your left hand to your chest. Giving yourself a moment here to tune into your breath. Feel the air filling you up and emptying you out. As you pause, tuning into your breath, Take a moment to let go of any labels like tired or exhausted. Peel off any labels you're holding onto like sticky notes. Peel off those labels and what those labels mean. Crumple all those post-it notes up and toss them to the side. And instead, really tune into how you feel. Does your right hip feel heavier on the floor than your left? Do your shoulders feel relaxed? Is your jaw clenched? What's physically happening? Without judgment, without label, just really be in your body. your breath to grow a little bigger. As you inhale, feel the belly rise and then the chest. As you exhale, feel the chest lower and then the belly. Feeling the breath roll through you like waves. Placing the hands if they're still on the body, maybe turning the palms up by the side, signifying surrender. As you feel the breath expanding into your body, imagining that your lungs are wings. As you inhale, feel those wings expand and open up to the sides. As you exhale, feel the wings draw in and hug around your heart. Inhaling the wings expand and stretch open. Exhale the wings close and hug the heart. Breathing the wings in to open. Breathing the wings out to close. Feeling your lungs like wings. your breath go. Let it be spontaneous and free. Feel yourself relax and let go.
your right heel. Send your awareness to your right heel. Without moving it, just imagine the energy of your right heel moving down into the floor. Feel the sole of the right foot. And now set your awareness into your big toe of your right foot. Feel the big toe on your right foot. Send your awareness now into your second toe, third toe, fourth toe, pinky toe. Send your awareness wholly into the right foot. Feel gravity and let go. Send your awareness to your right calf. Feel the front of the lower leg, your shin, back of the lower leg, where the calf is in contact with the floor. Big let go. Bring your awareness to your right knee. Imagine your right knee softening and unwinding as if you could screw your kneecap off your body and all of the tissue around it just instantly relaxes. Feel your awareness in your right knee. Now, bring your awareness to your right thigh bone. Feel the front of the right thigh. Feel the back of the right thigh. Where it is in contact with the bolster, the pillow, or floor. Holding your awareness in the whole right thigh and just think, let go. Now, send your awareness into your right seat, your right glute, where it's in contact with the floor. Feel gravity in your right seat. Say to the right seat, let go. Now bring your attention to your left seat. Feel the left sit bone heavy, left side of the body heavy. Say to the left seat, let go. Now bring your awareness into your left thigh. Feel the top of the left thigh and the bottom of the left thigh. Now the right thigh, top of the right thigh, bottom of the right thigh. Feel the two thighs apart and now together. Tell the left thigh to get heavier. Feel gravity in the left thigh. Say to the left thigh, let go. Now bring your awareness to your left knee. Imagine the whole left knee softening, tissue relaxing for more space. Maybe visualize the kneecap just gently coming off to the body. Say to the left knee, let go. Now, bring your awareness to your left shin, top of the lower leg. Bring your awareness to your left calf. Feel the top and bottom of the legs separately. And then together. Stay to the lower left leg, let go. Feel the left heel on the ground, let it be heavy. Feel the left sole of the left foot, top of the left foot. Stay to the left foot, left go. Send your awareness into your left big toe. Second toe, 
third toe. Feel your awareness in your fourth toe, your pinky toe. Say to the whole left foot, let go. Feel both legs completely relaxed. Bring your awareness to your belly. Imagine your stomach unraveling. Feel the knots in your stomach softening. Imagine your stomach getting larger, relaxing more. Visualize the stomach uncoiling. Visualize the stomach and say, let go. Bring your attention to the back of your neck. Very gently think about lengthening the back of your neck. Maybe your chin dips slightly. Feel the hands dropping down into the floor. Now, bring your energy and your awareness into your right shoulder. Feel it get heavier with gravity. Stay relaxed. Bring your awareness to your right bicep. Let gravity have your upper arm. Think, relax. Feel the right upper arm where it's in contact with the floor. And relax. Bring your awareness to your right elbow. Relax. Right forearm. Relax. Bring your awareness to your right wrist. Relax. Bring your awareness into the palm of the right hand. Back of the right hand. Feel your whole hand relax. Bring your awareness to your right thumb, second finger, middle finger, ring finger, pinky finger. Feel your whole palm. Think relax. Feel the whole right side of your body. Let it unwind, uncoil, get heavier, relax. Now bring your awareness to your left shoulder. Feel it heavy on the floor. Take your awareness to your left bicep. Feel the top of the arm. Your whole upper left arm relax. Bring your awareness to your left elbow. Relax. Left forearm. Relax. Bring your energy to your left wrist. Relax and bring your awareness to the left palm. Relax. Let the whole left hand relax. Bring your awareness into your left thumb. Left first finger, middle finger, ring finger, pinky finger. Feel the whole left hand in your awareness and relax. Left side of the body, let it get heavier and relax. Visualize more space appearing between all of your organs. 
So everything's floating a little bit farther apart. Let gravity continue to sink you down heavier and heavier. Waiting for the space between the breath where there's total stillness. attention to your right eye. Relax the space between your right eye. Now, bring your attention to the left eye. Relax the space behind your left eye. Feel your left cheekbone relax. your right cheekbone, relax. Feel the top lip, bottom lip, the roof of the mouth, back of the tongue, relax. Floor of the mouth, relax. Gently let the teeth separate and relax. Feel the back of your head on the floor and think relax. Feel the space between your eyebrows, your third eye center and say relax. Now visualize on the screen of your mind the following things for a few seconds each. Let's start with the color blue. Looking out the window, seeing the snow fall on a snowy day. A baby laughing. The sun shining. Visualize yourself smiling. Take a moment and simply feel. Let yourself be, let yourself be held by the support of the earth. Feel yourself loose, slack, supported. Feel your whole body relax. Allow yourself to feel heavy. Cultivate the sense that your body is recharging, refueling. Hold yourself in this healing space. <clears throat> Wherever you are, you are supported, recharging, refueled.
take the next 15 to 20 breaths to refuel as much as possible. Inhale, belly rises. Exhale, belly falls. Just one breath. Imagine every body part recovered, refueled, every cell renewed. Visualize yourself. See yourself lying peacefully on the earth, supported, renewed. Visualize yourself in your mind's eye. to yourself these words. May I be peaceful. May I be happy. May I be healthy. May I be joyful. Now saying to someone you love, visualize that person and say to them, May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be healthy. May you be joyful. I'm not saying to someone you're neutral about, visualize them and say to them, may you be peaceful. May you be happy, may you be healthy, may you be joyful. You know, someone you don't care for, may you be peaceful, may you be happy, may you be healthy, may you be joyful. Visualize yourself lying on your mat. See the relaxed expression of your face. See the gentle lift and lower of your belly with your breath. Now visualize yourself lying on a white sandy beach. Feel the warmth of the sand curving up into the back side of your body. Feel the warmth of the sun on your skin. Feeling a cool breeze pass over you. Feeling the cool, cool mist from the ocean spray. Hearing the ocean, the waves crash into the shore. 
hearing the leaves of the trees fluttering in the breeze. Smell the salty air. Visualize yourself lying on a white sandy beach. Notice how you feel. Very gently deep in the breath. riding the breath like waves in the ocean. Feeling more rejuvenated with every breath. Taking your time, bring some gentle motion to the body. Head can rock side to side, circling wrists and ankles. Head a little side to side, maybe you're ready to take the arms overhead, a little bigger stretch. Really slowly, gently, take your time, bend the knees, roll to a side if that's comfortable. Couple deep breaths, maybe open the mouth, cleansing side and out. Go slowly, press yourself up to seated. Take your time to move, stretch. our practice here. Thank you so much for joining me. It was a fun experiment. I hope you feel relaxed, rejuvenated, ready to cruise into a REM cycle maybe. But yeah, for those of you I can't see, you might be asleep. That's cool too. It's nice because we're already home. Yay! Thank you all so much for joining. Happy to have you.
see it. Thumbs up. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Carolyn. Thanks for tuning in. You're welcome so much. Yeah, you guys let me know. We'll see how this time slot worked out. Hey, Becky. My little light went out about midway, so I had to turn the big light on, hopefully. I was like, I hope it isn't like a big bright screen. So hopefully that worked out. But um, yeah, I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. It was fun. You're very welcome. You're very, very welcome. Yeah. Uh, let me know uh, tomorrow.